Well, we, we've gotten married several times. Yeah. And right. We just keep renewing About our vows. Four. So, yeah. How come you keep renewing your vows? Well, let's see. The first time we got married, they because it's fun. It's fun. There was no legal status. <laughs> then, it, when Massachusetts said, you know, it's okay to be married, and then when the feds recognized it, and then our thirtieth anniversary, <laughs> and we just went on and on. It's like, oh, it's Mary and Leslie. They're getting married. They're again. getting married again, <laughs> and we have cake every time. So Yummy. Cake every time. You can't beat that. Well. When Hurricane Maria struck Puerto Rico, of course, we were very upset. And one day we were at the kitchen table and my spouse, Mary, who's from Bayamon, was reading the newspaper and she looked up with tears in her eyes and said, what about the coquis? And she just looked like a little girl. And I just thought, what can I do about this situation? And I thought, well, I can write a children's book to offer hope. Uh, to the children of Puerto Rico, and really to all children whose lives have been disrupted by natural disasters. How did you get the name Alicia? Well, Alicia is actually my spouse Mary's um, birth name. She was adopted, but originally she was named Alicia, so I wanted to use that name in her honor. I really wanted to end the book on a hopeful note because there was so much going on in a way that was very hopeless, especially the administration's response to the hurricane. So what, what was really very moving to me was how communities got together to help each other, and I really wanted to portray that in the book.